What's up guys, so a lot of you have asked me what machine I use, so I wanted to do a video on it real quick. So this is the machine I use, it's an injector. It's the limited edition black, um, it's the Flight Nano. Um, and it's an amazing machine. So this is the box it comes in, a nice little wooden box. This is the actual machine itself with the, with the grip it comes with. And you get a certificate of authenticity straight in the Flight Nano Elite. Um, it comes in with these. So when you, so a good thing about this machine is that it comes with these torsion bars, um, which are really, really good because it allows you for freedom and what sort of like how hard the machine hits and stuff. So I, I used to use this black bar, which is just a straightforward, you know, there's no, um, no give on it. So it's quite hard hitting. So you have to rely on how you move your hand and, and, and a lot of hand movements to get the kind of shading you want. Um, recently I've used the medium torsion bar, which is in there now. Um, and you get a hard one and then a soft one. So you can see the diameters on these are smaller and bigger. And then this one in, in the machine I'm using now is the medium one, so it's the one in, in, in between. So if you look at the instructions, you can see, you can see, uh, so it, if you want the machine to hit hard, you use the largest diameter, which is this one. And if you want it medium, then you can use the medium and soft, you use the smallest one. So each bar has three tension settings. So it's kind of confusing, but when you look at, look at this, you can turn it to whatever way. So I think, what does it say on here? It says, so the, soft, the softest on the hardest torsion bar is when the three nibs are on this side. And then you can go medium, which is that. So a tiny bit showing. And then the soft, and then the hardest alignment, sorry, is when it's like that. So you've got no give in it because these are like flexible. Um, so I just use it with the, the hardest in the medium just because it's, it just works for my, how heavy I am with my hand, which isn't that heavy. Um, so I liked something, but yeah, I would recommend just using this if you don't want to mess around with the torsion bars. So yeah, so that's basically it. I run my machine at 10.5 volts, um, 10.5 to 12 volts. I think in, I think this one can go up to 18 volts, but that's really high. Uh, motor is rated from 4.5 volts to 18 volts, which is super high. Like you would just chew the skin up pretty quickly if you run that at 18 volts. So. I sort of, I, I'm, I'm quite fast. I've got quite a fast, when I'm, you, when I'm using the machine, I'm quite fast. I've got like a fast hand movement. So that's why I run mine quite quick. So I don't like really chew it up, um, chew, chew the skin up. So yeah, so that's a bit about <coughs> my machine. And uh, yeah, thank you for watching. <laughs> Um, if you've got any questions about this, let me know. I just wanted to give you a quick video because a lot of you have asked to do a video on my machine. Um, the grip comes, like everything you see here comes with this machine. I think it's about £600. Um, you know, it's got an interchangeable cam system. So from like 2.5 to 4 mil. So that's basically why I got it because you can literally customize everything on this machine to suit whatever you want. But it kind of does get confusing. So if you're just starting out, it's definitely not a starter machine and you can you can adjust how hard it hits. So you can go, um, you know, semi-rigid, rigid, hard, medium and soft, you know, um, it's a really, really solid construction. You know, it's metal, so it's not gonna, you know, break easy and stuff. So you don't really need to oil it. The only thing you need to oil is where in there. So if I take this off, this is the only thing you need to oil um, is the end that goes into here, which if your machine sounds loud, then that's, you, you, you just need to oil in there. But yeah, it's pretty low main, maintenance. So you shouldn't, you shouldn't um, oil the cam head. Um, it's oiled already, so yeah, don't oil the cam head. 
Um, and that's about it. It's you know low maintenance, an amazing machine. Um, a lot of the pros use it, and I've come to love it over the last six months that I've been working with it. So yeah, um, cheers for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next video.